All right, so I'll put up my weights real quick right here. All right, so from the beginning to 10 weeks in, so I did my 11th injection 10 weeks in, 40 pounds. So, I mean, it's good. You know, I should be excited, right? But I'm just, I'm not feeling it here in my gut. I did start around 48 inches and I'm 45 and a half, uh, somewhere in there. So I am two and a half to almost three inches down around the midsection. Um, my, my boobage, I, I might be an A cup where I was a B cup before. So that's good. Whenever I do my injection, like, well, excuse me, when I did my injection last week and when I did it today, I had the dry mouth for about an hour and then it went away. So, uh, the symptoms are less and less and less. So I don't know if that means that my body's used to it and that's a good thing or it's used to it and it's time to go up on a dose. So I think last week I said that my doctor's appointment was the first or second week of uh, November. Um, it's actually November 16th or November 18th is my, uh, my next doctor's appointment. Saying that though, I do get blood work tomorrow. And so next Thursday, I should have some blood work to compare and to show on next week's. Uh, other than that, uh, dehydration is still a little bit there. Uh, I, I just, I can't seem to get enough water. I don't want to overhydrate. Uh, cause it, it, again, I've said this before, if your urine is like that, that means you have your, you're expelling all your electrolytes out. So you need to make sure that you're taking the electrolytes. I take my electrolytes, something like liquid IV, LMNT, uh, electrolyte pill. There's something good for your electrolytes. I had one of my um, subscribers reach out to me. Uh, he, I'll leave a link to his YouTube down below. His name is Jay. He's on Wagovi. So if you're wanting to see maybe the difference between Wagovi and see where he lies in three months or two months, excuse me, versus where I'm at in two months with the Manjaro because you're on the fence. You don't have diabetes, but yet you want to use it for weight loss. You want to wait until just after Christmas. Uh, to start your New Year's resolution, then uh, again, I'll leave a link to his. But he was mentioned in there that he was on it before and that uh, he lost some bone and muscle. Uh, so one big thing, yes, our digestive is slowing down. So we're not, in, we're not intaking a lot on our nutrients anymore. And I said this last, in, in actually a couple of videos, you need to be making sure you're taking a good multivitamin for one. You got to get your vitamins because you're getting less that you're eating in since you're, you're, you're satiated, right? You're full. So you need to make sure that you're, you're taking in a good multivitamin. You need to make sure you're taking magnesium, potassium, you know, you're getting your essential vitamins that you do need for it. The other thing is when he was talking about the muscle, make sure that you're taking protein. If you really and truly are having a hard time eating because you're saying nauseous or whatever else, grab you. I, yes, it is a little, a little expensive depending on where you get it, but you can go to GNC or anywhere and you can get the tub of protein for about 40 bucks. It's something like 30 servings or 40 servings in it, uh, depending on which one you get. I like Synthesis. That's just me. That's one of my favorite ones. Or the GNC Extreme. They taste good. They you know, they taste like they're sweet, even though they're not. I, I really enjoy mine, but you need to be drinking protein. So remember, you need one gram of protein uh, for every one pound that you are, something like that. Go, go look it up for you, uh, for your height, your weight, you know, your age, uh, male, female, look up yours. But like me, I'm supposed to be taking in something like 160 or 180 um I might even be 200 grams of protein a day. So I get a lot of mine from chicken and beef, but I also drink my protein shake. So make sure you get protein. Protein also is going to help keep the lean as you're losing where you're not getting that sag. So see, I still got some sag here, but it's not as saggy as it once was. And see, I can just sit here like this and look at that. I'm starting to even get my bubble back for my muscle right here. I'm starting to get that definition back in there. And then if I, you know, turn it and come back around, I am getting my definition back into my arms. I need to really, really focus on my triceps uh, to get that flab down. My neck, I don't know. One, one, one day I see that it, it looks good. Next day I don't. 
But at the same time, I'll come in here and I'll look at videos from two months ago or even three or four months ago since I do multiple things for videos. And it's like my face is like this big around. So I know that I'm, I got weight that's going off of me. I get that. Um, but again, I want more here. Uh, my legs, my arms, that's the biggest, the biggest, biggest where I've lost weight is my leg and, legs and arms. Uh, my, my buttocks, you know, I lost some weight there. Uh, even my daughter's like, all right, you got to start wearing the belt. You know, my shorts are falling off of me. Uh, I even got some of my old shorts that I haven't been able to wear. Uh, like I showed it last week. I haven't been able to wear a lot of these shorts. I mean, heck, the ones I got that I wore yesterday, um, there are some board shorts. I haven't been able to actually ever wear them whenever I bought those. So I was actually able to put those on and uh, they were loose. They weren't even tight on me. So, which is a plus, but I need this up here to go down because I got a lot of these shirts. As you notice, I mean, you'll probably start seeing me in different shirts than what I normally am because now I get to start pulling out. I have something like a hundred shirts. I, I, I'm like a girl when it comes to shirts and shoes. I got like 45 pairs of shoes in there. It's insane. Like I'm no joke, no lie. I have about 45 pairs of, of shoes in there. Um, my wife has like four or five. Then my daughter has like 12. And then I have a 45. I think that's where we were at. We're at with my boots and my two pairs, a uh, pair of flip-flops and a pair of sandals. I think I'm at 45. Uh, it was like 47 with my two pairs of house shoes, uh, which I hardly ever even wear house shoes. I can't stand my feet to be hot. But anyways, um, food-wise, again, I think I might need to go up because... Um, I can sit there and eat and I'm not feeling sick r right away. Not that I over ate before, but what a real true serving is and it's hit and miss. Like, so like last night I ate sloppy, I make homemade, so I make the, the bomb sloppy joes. I don't go buy that manwich in a can. I make some really, really good sloppy joes. Um, I make it all homemade scratch everything, but I made the sloppy joes and uh, I eat mine open face. We take, the two buns like this, and then you put the cheese on top if you use cheese, but I don't eat it as a sandwich. I just like this and I cut it up and eat it. I was already getting into my, uh, my second half. I'm like, all right, how come I'm not getting full? I know I, I get halfway through it and then I'll put that other half up for lunch or for, uh, you know, something else, a leftover for later on. So all I did, so I didn't want all the carbs. I scraped off the meat and I ate the meat or majority of the meat. So, uh, and then I had a few of my fries. I asked my daughter if she wanted the rest of the fries because, I mean, I couldn't. At that point, I was already getting way too full. And I already, I don't want to eat past that once I'm feeling full. But at the same time, if I'm not feeling full, that that quickness of feeling full, then I know I'm going past that one serving. But that's my uh, my weekly review update of the Manjaro. I'm Thomas with Tomology. If you like tech reviews and or, you know, review vlog reviews like this, go ahead and hit that uh, like button, uh, comment down below, uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed. I bring a lot of tech news. Matter of fact, you'll see it. It's going to be right here on one, one side of the screen. It's probably already going on right now um, uh, of the latest for your, your hard-earned money. Again, I'm Thomas Tomology. I'll catch you in the next one.